Hello, today we are going to be making a little animal ear. Um, I think it's like, it looks like a baby bunny or possibly a um, little lamb's ear. I'm going to add this to a, to a little hoodie I'm working on, but you can use it for anything really. So I'm going to slip knot and chain seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we are going to be working on both sides of the chain. So the first thing I'm going to do is chain um, is single crochet in the second chain from the hook. One, and in all the chains I'm going to have six single crochets. I'm just using a pink Aran yarn. I think it's um, it's just from my stash, but I think it's paint box. Um, I don't remember which color it is because I lost, I lost the um, sleeve for it. So there, one, two, three, four, five, six. Now I'm going to turn my work, and then I'm going to work into this side of the chain and put and do six single crochets. One, so that's in that same one that we just ended off in. It's in the same um, part of the chain. Then I'm gonna go two, three, four, five, six. Right. So this is going to be the top of the ear where this um, um, tail is, and then this is going to be the bottom. Now I'm going to just trim, cut this off. Oh, excuse me. And I'm going to add my main color, which I'm using this. It's called Leader of the Pack. It's from Hobbycraft. And it's um, partly alpaca. And, a, and then the other bit is acrylic. Okay, so I'm going to do a slip knot, put it on my hook. Um, so I haven't done anything, like I haven't slip stitched or anything. I'm just going to continue working around now. So let's. Join the new yarn and chain one. Pull these. Okay, there we go. So we're going to keep continue on in the round. So I'm going to do five double crochet or single crochets. Let me just check my pattern to make sure I'm doing it correctly. Yeah. So I'm going to do five. One. Two. Three, four, five, and then I'm going to put two single crochets in this last, at the top part of the ear. One, two, and turn the work to walk, work around the other side, and we're going to put two in the next one. One, two and then five single crochets in the remaining stitches one two three four five all right so that is on that's my join there and now i'm going to slip stitch to the first single crochet that we made. Okay, that's the, that's right here is the chain. So I'm gonna slip stitch to that first stitch. Okay, 
Okay, now we're gonna continue on to the last row and we're gonna chain one. And we're gonna single crochet in the next six stitches. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm gonna put two single crochets in this next stitch. One, two, and two single crochets in the next stitch. One, two, and then six single crochets along this edge. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so this looks like there's a stitch here, but that was our slip stitch, which I'm gonna skip. And then that's the chain here. So slip stitch, chain. And I'm gonna just slip stitch into that first single crochet. Now what happens is it makes it a bit more 3D that way, because we've, we have, um, increase the stitches at the top but not at the bottom so then it becomes this perfect little ear okay now i'm gonna cut that off so i would make this a bit longer because i'm going to use that to sew my ear on and then i'll just weave in all of these ends there your perfect little baby animal ear